one in the last frame, one in this one. Well, not the best safety there, although that red has just come down to stop the red that he could have taken. Yeah, well played. Now, where's it going to finish? The kiss there on the red, couldn't it? Yeah, if he'd have got the kiss, needs another good pot. Four. Well, oh, that's a belter. It really is, because he would have left that red on had he missed it. John Murphy was unlucky to leave the plant on, but he didn't play a good safety. He shouldn't have been able to see that side of the Reds, Ian Wembo. Eight. Oh, another cracking pot. Just one awkward Red. Twenty points the difference. The red must go to the middle. Ninety. Just trying to give himself a few moments here, wipe down the queue, get the cue ball cleaned, little swig of water, prepare himself, because we've been here before. Murphy pounced of course in the previous frame when it all went wrong and he's ready to do so again if it goes wrong in the next couple of shots. Well, if he should win this match, I'd take my hat off to him. With that, he lost the last rain. Twenty. Oh, well, still work to do. Had he finished on a colour there, Almost certainly he would have won, but he's not on one. 21 points, the lead. He's thinking of taking the yellow one. It's a tough pot. It's not far away, but it didn't ball. turn into the pocket. Well, now, has he got lucky? He was willing it in. You could see him, couldn't you? In the background, and he's covered it. So down to the colours in the deciding frame. But Murphy knows Liang realistically now. Just needs one more chance. Yeah, he can hit it, that's for sure. But what can he do with it? He could come off the black cushion and try and push the yellow to the cushion. Well, Leanne got a bit overexcited there. He dropped his bottle on the floor.
think that was the shot all day long. And I think it's just about got the pace right. A little harder, it would have been an easy yellow. I don't think he can take the risk on playing the yellow. Looks easy on TV, doesn't it? Yellow and green. Murphy needing them all. Yeah. And again. If he decides to take the yellow one, he's got to play it dead weight to hold for the green. If he plays it at pace to come in and out of balk, he risks missing the yellow. And that's if he decides to take it home. Was well, that the white clean, which is often a sign that the player is going to go for the pot? And uh, he's taken a couple of deep breaths noticeably as well. Yeah, he played it dead weight. That was the only way to be sure of being on the green. He looks back to see if it's potable. So well, it is. And he's on the green. It's down to Murphy. Well, if he can clear these, he may wonder how he's won it. <laughs> Leanne Wembo went for broke on the yellow, but of course he had chances before that, not least the last frame when he was just two balls from winning Mr. Red to the left middle. Five. Well, everybody feels pressure. There's no doubt about that. Some are better at handling it. We know that Murphy certainly is. Still needs a clearance though. No. Yeah, I think he can play it with deep screw to get back to the black. Twenty. Well, it's been a great match. This Murphy led three one. Leanne Wembo hit back breaks of eighty five, ninety, sixty eight, fifty nine. He was poised to win five threes, had chances to win five four. But Sean Murphy has Sean made Murphy. the clearance you, from yellow to black, a little nod of the head. He went right down to the last ball, and it is Sean Murphy who progresses to the second round of this European Masters. What a terrific match it was. Great entertainment. Liang will surely look back very disappointed. He couldn't quite close it out. Murphy, the winner, five four.